Hello friends, welcome to Info, and here we are going to continue our little CRUD application and after this uh, project, after this video, we will continue with our actual student enrollment system which will involve authentication and relationships. But here this is the last video of this little CRUD project, CRUD means create, read, update, delete and we are going to finalize this video, finalize this project. So I'm going to fix this button, I'm going to after editing a record i will get a proper message over this over this page and uh, I, i'm also going to make it a normal delete instead of instead of soft delete so let's fix this button first okay so come here and uh, this is our page student uh, model close it and go to your view file so this is your view and student app and layout.play.php here and uh, if you go below so you will see this is the okay this is a layout and here we are going to show students so this one is the here we are showing the uh, all the list of students who are added in this application and uh, what i'm going to do i'm just going to include this uh, session success here in this file so i will simply say inside container not out of the container inside session we have uh, one success.delete.php so i'm going to include this success page so we'll get the success message after successfully updating the record save all refresh the page edit and update you will see a uh, success showing record updated successfully it's perfect and i want to do something else here Here we are updating the record, right? So we are getting the student find and we are sending the message as success. Here I can embed uh, attach one name like what the student record we are going to we, uh, we have updated, right? So you can simply say mm, the old one, the state student. Arrow student name. Top. Now let's see the output. Fresh and uh, edit. So it's this one. I'm 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 going to update it. So what I will get is one record has been updated successfully. So update it, and you will see the this one record has been updated successfully, right? So it's working nicely. And uh, what uh, next? Uh, I'm gonna fix this these two buttons. So which is our in view file? Let's go the view file show student this is our view file and this is here oh, what's the problem is if you're good at ui then you will come to know this is a inline element but this delete it's a it's, this button is inside form and form is a block level ele element so we are just going to assign uh, this form a style attribute with the uh, display inline right so say here Now it's looking very nice. Edit. 
and you see you will get the name record has been updated successfully if you delete it then it will be deleted and i'm also going to remove the soft delete for now so if you go inside the student model so here is our model and uh, comment it for now save all refresh and see we'll have all the soft deleted record here because we have removed the soft deleted feature from the model and if you come here and you'll see this trend controller where we are, here we are building so we don't need to show this one here we'll see uh, here we'll just simply write the return statement save all and refresh now try to delete one of the records so let's delete and you'll see the student record uh, student record has been deleted and now i'm going to show you the feature of first getting the record and then deleting so here we are just getting the primary key and we're passing it to the destroy method then it is deleting just comment it for now and enable this get this trend uh, record so we got, got the trend and we are deleting it and just take the take this return statement from here and paste here okay so you can say here so this is adv advantage of getting the record first and then deleting you can say uh, the name of the student whose record is actually deleted save all refresh and let's delete this first one and you can see the Adil Khan record has been deleted and it's so easy we don't need to do so much coding it's just simple get the record and display it okay so all of you can delete all of them together so we are done with the we are getting the success message if you're editing now it's working fine so this is the finalizing of this crud operation if you have any idea or if you want any modica modification in this uh, small project just uh, let me know in the comment section and in the next video we will discuss about this student enrollment system and we will use the feature of this crud in this student enrollment system thanks for watching don't forget to like and subscribe